I started in 2014 out of my house uh, for CrossFit Hippo. Trained buddies, wives, and people around the neighborhood and whatnot. Quickly outgrew that and then moved into a bigger space. We wanted a space with showers and we could uh, spread out and do a little bit lifting and whatnot. So a myth about CrossFit is that you have to be in shape to start. Um, I was not in shape when I started. I thought I was in shape, but I wasn't. Um, people just need to start. You know, anybody can do this. It's all. I hear a lot of people say that they'll get hurt, that it's too intense, that I'm too old, that I have injuries, and all of those things. They they may be true in your mind, but they're not necessarily true when it applies to CrossFit. If you have a knee injury, we can work around that. If you have a bad bad back. Uh, we can work around that as well. Part of part of getting over injuries is strengthening the muscles around the joints that are that are hurting. Uh, so anybody can do it. We have clients from 10 to 65. And literally, uh, the 65 year olds are loving it. They get in here and they, they kill it. And they talk as much trash as anybody. Um, CrossFit Hippo is different because we're like a big family. Um, it's a lot cleaner than other gyms. We. You wouldn't go grab a dude off a bench at 24 Hour Fitness and say, hey man, you want to go get a beer? Because that would be weird. Uh, here, we all go out, we hang out together, we do happy hours, we're going bowling, we did stand up paddle boarding. Um, it, it's much more of friendships. I've been to a lot of CrossFit gyms and none of them are like this as far as the community and the, the bond. Uh, we're, all, we're all family. Uh, I like to watch people win. I like to watch people win. Watching someone think that they can't do something, and then one day they can, and that, that, that light in their eyes, they're like, oh my God, I just jumped on the box, or oh my God, I just got to pull up, or I, I've never done a real push up, or whatever. It's just, it's exciting to see uh, people winning. There's not enough of that today.